I'm Professor Wendy Hall, University of Southampton. Wonderful. And thank you so much for taking time out of your busy afternoon. So we're working with new leaders in the field of online learning, and it's a very uh, fast, complex, developing environment. What advice would you give to a, to a person just stepping into this role? Well, I think you need to understand the ecosystem that you're working in. And, you know, this is something we, that's been evolving for just over 20 years, and we're beginning to see the patterns and the trends and how it works. And you need to look at how the web evolved and the history of how the big companies emerged and realize that actually there are things you can do. Um, you have to, and if you understand what's going on, that really it, it's winner takes all in the web world. Um, as as a, a type of application emerges, like the social networks, over time everybody goes, it's a bit like survival of the fittest. Mm. Everybody goes mm. to the one that works best mm. for the masses. Mm. And then it's very, very hard to come up with an alternative to that. So over time, there's okay. one shop, there's one place you watch your videos, there's one place you, you put your photos. and. Uh, so you need to be tuned into that. You need to be tuned into that. And it's, it's so important. I, I think about the publishing industry who are struggling to keep um, the... Oh, the, the traditional methods of disseminating information going, which are based on a completely defunct uh, model of paper-based uh, publishing. And, um, you know, they're trying the paywalls and uh, maybe advertising will work for them. But alongside that, there's a whole new publishing industry emerging, which is of the web. And uh, that's, where, that's where you need to be. So one, one more for you, because I know this afternoon you shared this history of such rich network that you have of not just computer network, a people network. How important was that for you over, over the career? Oh, well, I'm a people person. I love people, and I never imagined I'd become a computer scientist because, like a lot of people, oh, think okay. that's just me and my computer. But um, to me, it's how I've always been interested in how people use computers and how mm. computers can help mm. people do what they want to do. So uh, I just uh, someone who makes links all the time and I have a big network of people and I, that's what I enjoy about life. Wonderful, wonderful. Thank you so much and thank you for sharing. And you Pleasure. did a wonderful job. Thank you.